Imagine a church that is full of people who are worshipping God together, content with the Sunday services and happy with things as they are. Then along comes a young curate, on fire with the gospel and wanting to spread the good news to people who wouldn't dream of stepping foot in a church. In 1882, this was the dilemma which Wilson Carlyle faced. In response, he established Church Army. His vision was to train ordinary Christian men and women to share the gospel with those most in need. He began by holding open-air gatherings to share faith and encourage faith to turn into action. As Church Army grew, Carlisle focused the charity's work on the slums of Westminster, one of the darkest spots in London. Since then, we have continued to follow God's call to share the good news of Jesus and to usher in God's kingdom. We are Church Army. In 1883, Church Army was officially recognised by the Church of England. The training of commissioned evangelists began and a social action took the form of men's and women's homes, social work in the slums, prison work and horse-drawn mission caravans. At the turn of the century, the need to support those facing unemployment became a strong focus through residential care in homes and marquees. This era also saw pioneer tent missions, beach missions, the church army printing press and the making of films for evangelism. Church Army was active during both the First and Second World War, where Church Army was working both at home and overseas, providing much needed recreation huts for the armed forces, operating ambulances, mobile canteens and kitchen cars. We also opened training centres for men who had been left disabled by the fighting. In the new age that dawned, many evangelists were employed to work with children and young people, the future generation. Youth centres were built and relationships developed with scouting and guiding associations. We continued providing hostels for homeless men and women and care homes for the elderly. Today we continue to build on the foundations laid by Wilson Carlyle through our vision for everyone everywhere to encounter God's love and be empowered to transform their communities through faith shared in words and action. We began with one man and have grown into the church army we are today. A society of evangelists authorised by the Anglican Church. We're a mission community, people with a passion for evangelism, holding on to the same heart we've always had for the marginalised, vulnerable, those on the edges of society, and seeing God's love and hope break into people's lives. <laughs>